What's up everybody? Donnie here. Welcome back to another video. Man, I'm stoked. Today we're targeting Pompano first thing in the morning. And then um, after that, we're probably gonna go for snook, redfish, trout. Uh, that's probably gonna be in a different video. But first things first, we're targeting Pompano. It's real early in the morning, it's like seven o'clock and tide's coming in. So that should be good. We're gonna be fishing the jetty up there. Hopefully we get on them, man. Stay tuned. just pulled up to the uh, spot here. There's already like a few boats here, but um, I don't think they're fishing for Pompano. These are, uh, these are captains look like. They're just um, throwing white bait, but we're gonna be jigging for Pompano using Doc's Goofy Jig. Hopefully, uh, hopefully they run through here. Uh, I've caught Pompano here in the past with live shrimp, or actually jigging, but my friend caught a really nice one on a dead shrimp. This was a few months back, but it's springtime. So hopefully, uh, hopefully they're here, man. Only one way to find out. Fish on, baby. First one, let's go. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dang ladyfish, thought it was a pompano. Fish on, baby. This might be the target species right here. Let's go. Oh yeah, that's a good fish. Oh yeah, that's a good fish, boys. That is a good fish. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's go, man. These fish never get old. Right here. Let's go. First one of the day. Not bad. That's a keeper right there. Look at that, man. That's a keeper. We'll take him. That's probably like 12 inches to the fork there. Good deal. Let's throw him in the box and uh, keep on jigging. First pompano of the day to start the morning off, a 12-incher. Where there's ladyfish, sometimes the pompano will be mixed in too, man. So if you're catching ladyfish, that's a good sign that there, there might, be a, might be a pompano nearby. And just keep on jigging, like what I'm about to do now. It's gonna, there's gonna be a lot of jigging today, but uh, it'll be worth it though. Let's go. That's a good fish right there, boys. Solid. Solid pompano. Here we go. Oh yeah, that's a good one. That is a good one, man. Strip and drag. Oh yeah, that's a stud. No, he's about the same size as the other one. That boys, that's a better one. That's a better one right there. Let's go, man. Two so far, not bad, not bad. The tide just started like, I think it's outgoing tide right now. Uh, I don't know if it's, the, if, near, if it's near the end of outgoing tide or not, but uh, the tide is somewhat slow. So I'm able to work the bottom better and caught two. All right, guys, two pompanos so far. Man, pompano fishing never gets old to me. I swear, I can do this all day long. <laughs> so much fun, man. So what I'm doing is I'm just casting the, uh, the jig up current and then just letting it sink all the way down to the bottom and just work that bottom. 
just bouncing the jig along the bottom, let the current take the jig. And that's how I'm getting them. The tide is a uh, pretty good moving tide right now. It's not too strong yet. It's probably gonna pick up soon. And once it picks up, it might be hard for me to fish the uh, with the three eights. Might have to switch to half ounce. There's a lot of dolphins out here too. Yeah, feels like a ladyfish. Probably big old ladyfish here. What is this, dude? Oh no, it's a pompano. All right, man, that's a better one right there. Man, he was not fighting. He was he was hooked on the side a little bit. That's probably why, but that's a solid one. That looked like a 13 to the fork, 13 or 14 to the fork right there. Looks like the water's moving pretty good. Hopefully the bigger ones will come through now. Just literally casting it up current, guys, and just let it drift along the current. And just keep working that current. A lot of jigging, but that's, uh, that's pompano fishing. I mean, you can get them with live shrimp, fish bites and stuff like that, but I find that it's more fun to get them with the jigs. Cause like I said, all, you know, you, you, you're doing this, jigging, right? Working that jig along the bottom. And out of nowhere, someone's at the end of the line tugging, like really hard tug, digging, gotta love it. It's not jumping, I don't know. Oh, <laughs> look at that pompano guys. He freaking inhaled that jig too, or that teaser. Look at that, I swear man. I catch one of these guys on the jig like once a year or something. Pretty cool. If it ain't chartreuse, it ain't no use, right? All right. Let's put it back in the water. Man, he hit it way out there, guys. That's a good one. Strip and drag. The first initial run was sick, man. Let's go. Oh yeah. Uh, he's, he might be small actually. Yeah, he's small. We'll let him go. Yeah, that's... Man, he hit so hard though. What the heck? <laughs> Little guy. Let's get him unhooked and back in the water. Chartreuse teaser, baby. <laughs> Yellow. Yellow jig chartreuse teaser. That's my combo right there. I don't know if you guys noticed. <laughs> Alright, let's put him back in the water. Go. About time, man. Fourth one right here. Hopefully, we land them. It's a good one. We're right in that current, boys. As soon as I started pitching near the currents, I was on them. Oh, he's small. Let go. Tiny as heck. Dude. Look at this. See All right, guys, that is a wrap, man. My trolling motor like died completely. We weren't able to uh, spot lock anymore. So we're just, we're just gonna probably try to target something else. I mean, that trolling motor was going to work in the current, man. It's, it's three hours of nonstop, just, you know, cranking out power. But uh, it's, it's dead. We're probably gonna, Probably gonna go throw artifi artificial lures. Um, probably drift around uh, docks. Hope you guys liked the video. If you guys did, hit that like button, hit that bell notification, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next one.